Hello, it's Hanya here, Cole House Arts and Crafts. I have a 8 inch um, hexagon ceramic tile on my spinner. You can see the spinner is already a big mess because I just did uh, four little 4x4 four four tiles. So I'm um, do the same thing I did with those on the hexagon. We'll see what happens. We'll start off with um, some black as the base or bottom puddle and then I have uh, artist loft sap green I have a uh, master's touch silver mixed with some folk art silver flash Master's Touch Rogue. I actually do two layers of the new colors. Looks like I have plenty of paint though, it's already about to slide off the tile and crooked. Um, Amsterdam titanium white. I'm trying to do a bloom technique here. This is what we have right now, which looks really pretty. I almost don't even want to spin it. Oh my goodness. Ah, it's very, very pretty. I wanted to spin it. But if I spin it, chances are these little pretty cells right here are just going to fly right off. And you can see all this already off onto the spinner. Hmm. To spin or not to spin? That is the question. And the paint is going to fly if I spin this. spin.
it's okay that I shouldn't have spun it in the first place but obviously it had way too much paint on it but look at all that pretty pretty I'm probably going to attempt to scrape that off with a spatula the kitchen spatula see if I can scrape it off and put it onto a canvas It might not work out. It might just get all muddied and muckied up, but we will see. Um, yep, so that's that. I wanted to do the spinner specifically for uh, a Facebook friend who checked out some of my videos. So there you have it. Maybe next time I can spin out something a little prettier. Let me bring you down to look at it, though. Alright. Thanks for hanging out.